guys it's your girl here love in the city i am so glad to be on camera today saying hello to everyone i know i've been in my a for a minute i know i know but you know i'm coming back with a little some some i got a couple of videos uh in the near future that's coming your way so i hope you guys are happy to see me back on and i hope everyone is having a great week okay all right let's just jump right into it today guys this video is what a dollar tree haul i don't go to dollar tree that often but when i do go i try to get everything that i could think of that i possibly need you know stuff like that household stuff um and i actually need to make another one because i didn't find everything i wanted at one because sometimes i go to more than one honey i go to the one in john's creek which is near here and then there's another one off of Pleasant Hill. That's if you're in Atlanta. You know them streets I'm calling out. Uh, you may know them. I don't know. But uh, yeah, you know Jones Creek. I'm sure you've heard of Jones Creek area. But uh, yeah, that's like right up the road for me. But we're just going to jump right in. Nothing is in order, guys. I'm going to tell you right now. Ain't nothing in order. So um, yeah, you may see the top of my head. I'm going to go ahead and apologize to everyone now that you got to be looking at these roots up in this unit, y'all. Yeah, I like this. That's cute, y'all. <laughs> Let me stop playing around. But yeah, I got five bags. Yeah. And you're going to see me bend down and get them because that's where I got them all right here. So, and then also you're going to see me throw everything back in because otherwise I won't be able to move out this room. I mean, girl. All right. Here is the bag full of junk that I probably don't need. But I have a granddaughter. For everyone that's new to my channel, I only have one daughter. Honey, that's all your girl could do. I can't do it. My hat's off to everybody that's got multiple so Honey, that one killed me and I was done. But yeah, she's 25. And I have a grandbaby that just turned six, Miss Valentina. That's that's my little diva. I get to spoil her, honey. So that's mostly why I'll be going to Dollar Tree is to get a bunch of junk to ship to her because they are not here in Georgia with me. They are in Alabama, where I'm, I'm initially from. But I've been here 20 years. I moved here when my daughter was 5 and she's 25 now. Okay. Let's just jump right on in. And if they ever come to visit y'all, you better believe I'm going to put them on camera. Because I normally don't. But I, I may do that. They like to ham it up. They get it from me. Alright. We're going to start off with some cheeses. Because, you know, I've been on this diet thing because I've gained way too much weight just from the medication I have to take alone. So, I told the doctor to take me off. I'm only on one. And I've been cutting back on some stuff. So, instead of getting a big old box of cheeses that I would normally get, I'm going to just try to get the little ones. And I see that Dollar Tree carry these. So, I'll get the small one and I'll, I'll get the big one from Paul. He can eat like a like five people and don't gain the weight. I don't see how. Why do I have to gain all the weight? <laughs> Cause we eat the same stuff. Okay, guys, let's cheese it. Stick her back in the box. This is a puzzle. Make sure I'm holding it right, y'all. Looking in that viewfinder. This is a puzzle for Miss Valentina. That is my grandbaby's name, but Grandmama. Which is what I call her. I say, Grandmama don't call her Valentina. She my ladybug. Because she, when she was born, you know, she was like a cute little, like a, just like a little ladybug. So, ladybug stuff. So, that's what I call her. I call her Boogie for short. Or Ladybug. But this is for Ladybug. And, uh, yeah. She's going to school now. So, we will get her some puzzles. It says 5 plus. Because she just turned 6. So, yeah. And then, here's a cute little... Decorative bag. Look at that. Ain't that cute with the little rainbow colors on there? She gonna like that. I like because it, it was black with the colors on. And you know, uh, Halloween is coming up. So I got this bag too. I'm just gonna buy her a ton of candy. Yeah, I got the one to spoil. I can afford to spoil the boy. Hopefully my daughter keep up the trend that I did. <laughs> and I have any more, but if she do, that's on her. But honey... You can get a lot when you got one. But anyway, you can spoil them, I should say. You can spoil all of them, but baby, I can't afford to do that. My nerves too bad. That's why I had one. And she was like having three. Alright. Here else. Here's what else I got. Um, I'm not 
not sure if I want to keep this or give this away. I just got it because it was cute. So that's why Dollar Tree the devil. You go up in Dollar Tree and they make you get stuff that you know you don't need, but it's cute. And, uh, yeah. I may send this to to Ladybug. She leaves a little spark or wherever she goes. And I said my daughter was hanging in the room up high somewhere because you know children gonna be children honey Valentine probably had that plaque on the floor coloring on it all right what else I got here I'm just gonna pull this out right here which should be a little easier yeah all right here's something else for her Miss Ladybug it's a Disney book and you know I'm gonna explore her mind so I didn't just get one to color honey she gonna have to do a little work in this so just like a little workbook let me see if I can open it. See, there you go. Just lean back so y'all can see. You know, they got some activities. You're going to have to figure out some stuff, color some stuff, put the right shape, or whatever, whatever. Look at that. Yeah, honey. Minnie is winking her eye. Get a Minnie. All right. Put Minnie back in this bag. We're going to move right along. So if I'm going so fast, y'all, I'm sorry, but I'm trying to get through this video. Okay. All right, now this is for me because I have LED candles with remote control. You know, they require three AAA batteries. I know these are sunbeam. They probably ain't going to last that long, but they'll last for a minute till I go get my dirt cells. So I just grabbed these. I grabbed two of these. And this is, I'm so sorry, y'all. I didn't tell y'all what this was. This is sunbeam, but I know you're seeing it. Okay. Sunbeam. All right, I'm not sure if I want to keep this for a project or give it to Valentina. I'm up in the air, but you know, it's got some little girly stuff. So I'm thinking about just sending it to her, honey, and uh, let her draw whatever she wants to write and stuff like that. You know, Christmas coming up. I'm already starting my Christmas shopping in September. Yes, honey. Yeah, so I'm going to let that stockpile and the book and everything. This I got for myself because I like black and white. It says, be you, be bright, and be bold. Yeah, that's me. It's just got some line paper. I mean, some line paper inside. You never know when I have to jot stuff down. This is good for when you're doing your videos on YouTube and you you putting the, the uh, what you call it, code of the video when you do the video. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. All right. That one's for me. Actually, I got three more that I just grabbed because they was cute. Because, you know, never know. I may do a giveaway again or something. Or, you know, just to send some friend mail. I haven't sent that in a while. All right. This is a cute little card. Somebody may get this. Don't know. It just says thank you. Thank you. I won't show all of it. But I just thought that was so cute right there. That's, that's lovely. I like that. Right, and here's another one that I thought was very cute. It says, thank you so much. And these are like name brand cards. These are for like, forget me not. Okay, American greeting cards. Yes. That's very pretty. Isn't that pretty, y'all? That's grown up stuff right there. I like that. Keep it sexy and grown around here. Lord, I love this, by the way, Hap, I promise you. I'm like, okay, I'm 47. I'm like, I hope I ain't going through the change early. If you're eight, under 18 watching the video, I'm sorry, get off. But, honey, whoo, some time. But I'm like, I'm high with this hell. Oh, we. I actually got two of these. Like I said, I may give, keep one, give one away, or give them both away. I just like, it says, dream big, set goals, take action. You know, I'm the attack dog around here. <laughs> this was all gonna be all right and here's another one i thought i'll just keep it's just a little fat one in fact it says jot it's by the bread jot all that was jot y'all you know that uh spiral spiral fat book and it is a little fat book you've probably seen these hauls i'm not sure but you ain't seen your girl hold on 
And I just thought it was cute. And sometimes, you know, you have to jot stuff down. You need something. It's, it's small enough to go in my handbag. Because I like to carry big purses. I don't like the big ones. I mean, I got clutches and all that stuff. Mind you, clutches are for an event or a moment, honey. I don't just walk around every day carrying no clutch. But, yeah, I, I you know, unless I'm going to dinner. But if I'm not at dinner every day walking around, I like to have my big handbag. Boom, throw all my stuff in. All right. Let's move this one out the lap. I'm going to throw it over there and hope to God I don't accidentally knock down the camera. Because I'm going to cry if I do. That camera ain't cheap. All right, y'all. Uh, this is, uh, what you call it? I was about to say memory foam, but it ain't memory foam. I'm going to call it what it says right here. The cushion wrap, the bubble wrap. That's the generic, I'm mean, not the generic, the lamest term I was looking for. Bubble wrap. I only got one because they didn't have any more. But you know, I'm gonna grab some more. I haven't shipped anybody anything in a while. Well, I did ship my grandbabies and stuff because her birthday was September 11th. Yeah, she's born on September 11, 2011. Oh, yeah. I got this to send to my daughter and um, just put her some stuff in. I got another one here that matches it. One box that's square, and the other is uh, what you call it, round cylinder, square in the cylinder. But yeah, let's see what they look inside. The little thing says enjoy, and it's green inside, like a little lime green. And uh, yeah, I thought it was cute with the little glitter and whatnot. Or you know what? If you if you like to do DIYs and stuff like me, you could just buy your plain box, whatever. Get you some paper that's printed, and uh, get you some glue and some uh, what you call it, uh, glitter, and just do your own box like that. I I would. I see now I can use up my boxes because I got glitter. <laughs> I got plenty of glitter. All right. We got, we almost done, y'all. Oh, my Lord. Am I sitting on this thing? Okay, it was just stuck. Oh, Lord. That's why I don't do a bunch of dollar tree houses. I be having too much job. Okay, I'm just going to start with what's the closest to me, honey. Ah, Lord. All right. Here I have some reusable gloves. And I mainly bought these gloves. For doing DIYs and stuff when I'm spray painting stuff because you know the little latex ones whatever I don't have any more you know I need to get some more okay this is only one pair I need to get some more so when I'm like dying units because those little those little stink gloves they put in that box I'll be having dial in my fingers and I'm like okay why do I have dial on my fingers and I got gloves on I don't understand this is crazy all right what else I got here I got some kitchen towels. You know, these don't last too long, but hey, I'm going to hang these. I actually got these to hang on my stove because I got the color, uh, the brick red color in my kitchen with black and cream and whatnot. So, yeah. And then after a while, when it gets to a point, to a point where they don't still look nice to me, I throw them away and just go get some more. All right. Here I have some Brillo pads, or scrubbers, I should say, and uh, yeah, I got two pads. Normally they have the copper ones, but these are silver. So I was like, yeah, let's switch it up. I'm gonna get silver. So yeah, because honey, I don't like scrubbing the dishes. Let me tell you something. Every now and then, you know, I wash dish. No, we we use dishwasher up in this piece. <laughs> yeah, dishwasher. And uh, not knocking people who eat on paper plates, but I can't do no paper plates when I'm trying to eat my dinner. No, I need a plate. I don't know. Uh-uh. <laughs> okay. So, uh, here we go. We got some pomolas. Uh-oh. Trying to hold everything, which ain't working. Here's some pomola. Five what? What does it say on the back? Five X power because it's grease, odor. Yada yada yada. Remove stuck on food. And this is almond milk and blueberry. Hopefully the camera is zooming in on that. So honey, it'd be tripping. Okay, here are some garbage bags. Normally I get the pink ones because I got black and gray and white and pink in this bathroom. 
And uh, yeah, I like to have some trash cans that smell good, but these are lemon. I don't know if they smell good or not. And uh, I'm not gonna try to sit here and unwind to smell it. All right, and then this I keep for Paul's closet because you know men, they sweat or whatever and taking off their shoes and whatnot. I don't want the room to smell because we turned the second bedroom because we're empty, empty netters, nesters now. So, I mean, we ain't got to worry about how nobody else. Ain't nobody here but me and him. But, uh, yeah, we turned the second bedroom into a walk-in closet for he and I. I think I might have mentioned this before. I got some new people, but, yeah. One day I'm going to go in there. I just, mm -mm. We had a storm not long ago, so they got to repaint the ceiling for what the ceiling got wet in that room or whatever. I'm glad my clothes didn't get wet. Why I get? Why I do that on my side of the room? Okay, so one day, because I'm still decorating and getting little stuff, I don't know how I'm going to do it. Maybe I'll show y'all. Maybe. Don't hold me to it and then be messaging me. Tell my girl, we ain't going to show the room. Mm -mm, I don't know. Might not. All right. Here we go. We got one more bag after this, guys. We're almost there. All right. I'm going to do some DIY around this piece. Okay. This is some, uh, what you call it, that floor foam. This is bad. And I was holding it upside down. All right. Yeah, it just says dry sick. I don't know. Y'all know that foam that be a dog tree. And let's pull out the flowers. I'm actually going to do a little something, something from my front door. Ain't going to tell you just yet. And uh, this is burlap. Yeah. This is home of the Falcons here, baby. And they knew I like red. Red, I like red. Turquoise is my favorite because it's my birthstone. Well, actually, Aquamarine is my birthstone because I was born on Christmas Day. Hey, new peeps, yep. Your girl right here, I was born on Christmas Day. My mother was laid up in the hospital on Christmas Day in 69. Baby, yeah. Christmas coming up. I'm about to turn that big 48, y'all. I'm about to do it. Alrighty. So, anyway, red. And this is coordinating with the same yellow inside, even though one is burlap, one is not. I'm going to be doing some stuff. I may try to film it when I do it, y'all. I may. And uh, here's some more burlap stuff. I'm going to hold it close. See if that can zoom in. Those, that's, I think there's two butterflies in there. Yeah. Yep, there's two butterflies in each one. I like butterflies. I have a butterfly fairy tattoo on my back but yeah i'm gonna stick that in the situation with the flowers i got two of these y'all actually i got four but yeah these are cute okay because you know sometimes the, the the butterfly lands on the flower yeah oh well, i'm gonna do it i'm gonna fix it i got i got something brewing up in here y'all and here's a, a will it says willow reef honey but there's a little reef. Never knew the name of it. I just call it Wicker Wicker Reef. But yeah, this is small. I don't want anything too big on my door because I got something else on my door that I made out of some uh, burlap uh, ribbon and stuff. I made a bow and stuff that's already hanging on my door. And then I thrifted a little welcome sign. It's got a little black and white and polka dot. It's got all kinds of stuff on it. I think it got polka dot. I don't know. I'm not sure. All right. And speaking of polka dot, here's some burlap ribbon. That's burlap, and it's got that same red. How lucky was I to get that? Yeah, look at that. And then I got some Chevron. So, yeah, you know, it's all right to mix up some prints. So, I got, I'm going to have the burlap going. And I'm going to have the Chevron going. Okay. Don't y'all be stealing my idea because, you know, I show my video first. So, if you steal my idea, I'm going to see it. Oh, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, I'm going to do some stuff with this ribbon on that reef right there. And I got some more stuff regarding that. Now, you know, I just bought extra because it didn't want to run out. So, I got two of the tan. I'm going to have some bows and things going on. All right, and it's a perfect match to this. Just to show you guys. Okay. Everything's got to coordinate. It don't always have to go, but it has to coordinate. 
or should I say everything doesn't have to exactly match but it does have to coordinate you know what I'm saying and then I got some wire cutters when I'm snipping those flowers because you know I'm not going to use the whole thing I'm going to snip my flowers do what it do uh oh my burlap already falling apart and then I got my red burlap which I'm probably going to wrap around that situation I don't know we'll see that's some jute well actually it is not jute it's burlap now I'm about to pull up the jute alright I got this jute to do a DIY and I'm not going to do it with all that red situation that's kind of like a teal green because that's what I got going on in my bedroom and uh yeah I'm going to do something with this in a later date Right, let's get all this mess out the way, honey. We're about to do the last bag. I know y'all glad. <laughs> like, girl, you got all this stuff. Mm -hmm. If I ain't careful, I'll, I'll spend a, a grip up in there. I'll go in the Goodwill, spend a grip. I'm winning one time. <laughs> and I told Paul, man, I just spent a hundred dollars in the Goodwill. He looked at me, what? I was like, I didn't mean to. I mean, but I want, I want what I got. <laughs> Yeah, whole thing. I know he was going to tear me out, but he did because he thought I'd be mad. But yeah, all right. Here we got some pebbles, and uh, this is gonna go in a little vase in my room that I have sitting on and over there by my Audrey Hepburn uh, mural. I'll just call it the whole wall over there by Audrey Hepburn. Put that in that little glass vase that I have. And uh, got some bathroom cleaner. Yay. Because I don't like to scrub. Oh, I hate it. If I could hire somebody to come in here just to clean my tub and my toilet. Ooh, I would. But, you know, I don't like people in and out my house. All right. And then I got some uh, kitchen bags. This is tall kitchen bags. It's eight. I got these for Paul because he has, you know, a taller little, little can in his bathroom. And so we can, uh, you know maintain his trash and speaking of Paul we don't end this video about Paul here is for the Dollar Tree put this over here and I got him a bunch of socks now hopefully he gonna wear these socks I don't know he might not but hopefully he will I told him I had got him some socks when I went in the store but I wasn't gonna give them to him until I do my Dollar Tree haul but um at his job, you know, he works in sales, you know, it's a corporate office, and they have to be business casual. And, uh, yeah, I got some dress socks with these colors in it. It's like odd colors, purple and blue and black. That's one pair. And then the other pair is uh, like a teal and a light blue and navy blue. I'm sorry, was I not holding up good? Sorry, y'all had my head down. There we go. I was too busy reading the sock, looking at, trying to figure out the color of the sock. And then here's the other pair. I like this color. Like I said, you know, that's my birthstone color. And, the, you know, of course, the, the, the jute color right there, you know, I, I gravitate toward that color because, you know, it's my birthstone. But anyway, y'all, those are nice. There's three pair. And then here is the lone gray pair. It looks like little crosses on it, little little digital the, the designs on it. All right, and this is by who is this by? I don't know. It just says fit shoe size, fit shoe size eight to thirteen. Okay, okay. It should work because he wear a ten and a half. He's six three, y'all. So hopefully he won't say that these are too thin. I'll let y'all know maybe if I. If I do another haul and I grab some more socks, I'll tell you whether or not you like them. Okay, guys. This is the end of my Dollar Tree haul. And as I said at the beginning of this video, I'm so glad to be on camera to say hello to everyone. Kisses to everybody. And I hope you're having a great day or a great week. Bye.